So hi and welcome to another Valentine's Massacre review. And what are we reviewing today, cuz? The Loved Ones. Yes, as you heard David say, we have The Loved Ones. So it's from 2009 from Australia, directed and written by Sean Byrne. It's starring Xavier Samuels. From Twilight. Robin. Well, I wouldn't say that he's most known from Twilight. Okay. You know, Bait and other Oh, Bait, things. that's a good movie. It's Australian, yes. I'm also right. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And Robin McLevy, uh, John Brampton, Richard Wilson, Victoria Thane, and Jessica McNamee, who was in the uh, Blackwater Abyss, the new movie. Mm -hmm. Good movie, yes. So, The Loved Ones, what is it about, David? Mm, it's about a uh, school dance, end of the year dance, and uh, two friends who are going to this dance, and uh, a single girl who also wants a date for the dance in her own special way. Yes, and she likes one of the guys, uh, the main character played by Xavier, his name is Brent. So she asks him, mm -hmm. and he says no, because he's going with his girlfriend, Holly. Big mistake. And, yeah, so, you know, Lola... Mm -hmm. She doesn't take no for an answer. No, no, no. But, yes, so, thoughts on the film, David? Mm, it's a really good and scary movie. It keeps you on the edge all the time, and it pushes the limits, just, just really to the level, and it never goes above, so it gets like too much or too scary it always keeps you on the edge yeah uh, it does and it's always like it uh, so this thing happens and you're like oh shit that was woof and then they they take it like one one uh, notch up and yeah. then it goes up yeah you're like oh shit uh, how much is Brent gonna take and I mean Lola she's such an amazing character she's a well written psychotic character and she's played mm -hmm. so well by mm -hmm. Robin I mean they they did an amazing ca casting job yeah they, they the first did. time you see her she's just just a shy guy she feels like a little bit off but a shy guy shy girl who asks the lead brand out for a date and it's a snow and then when you find out who she really is it's just like wow yeah and I mean mm -hmm. this switch uh, sh she does it so well because yeah. sometimes when you act like you know, oh, I'm so innocent, and you're, and then you act like a, a psycho, mm. it's uh, not believable sometimes because that just that switch isn't uh, natural or something like that. But she 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 plays it so perfect. Mm. You're like, wow, this. Another oh. thing I like with the character is she doesn't have that much of a backstory. You kind of have to fill it in for yourself when you watch the yeah, movie. Yeah, you get like small details, clues yeah. here and there, but you, you really got to connect a lot of things in the film, not just about her, but about uh, all the different things that's going on around her and with uh, mm. the family and friends and stuff like yeah, that. So yeah. that was really good. Mm. And also the details in this film is really well made, yeah. like the crowns that they are wearing, her dress, the color, the theme song. Mm -hmm. I think the, the theme song... Grilling. Yeah, the, yeah. Th the theme song is spot on yeah. for her. Yeah, it really is. It's mm. so well picked. I like also. It's it's kind of in the hang of torture porn, mm. but they don't really show the like torture, gory stuff that much. You have some like you know what's going on, but you don't go into like in your face detail with the gore. Mm. You and see so some stuff. You, yeah. you do see, mm -hmm. but a lot of it is clever editing yeah. and sound. Yeah. It's the sound is yeah, probably it's really, the really good worst sound this thing. Movie. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, because mm -hmm. it, it makes it so believable. Yeah, yeah, and oh, and yeah, the character of uh, Lola's dad. I mean, that's a weird relationship yeah, right there. It's really well written characters for like this type of movie. Usually, yeah. the bad guys are just like effed up, crazy, cannibal, monstrous in some way. But here, they're, they're characters, and they're like more believable than most horror movies. Yeah, they, they feel kind of more out. human yeah. as well. Mm -hmm. Kind of relatable, but not really, but in yeah, a level. Yeah, there's a very interesting dynamic between the father, mm -hmm. who you would guess would be like the leading part uh, of this crazy duo, but uh, after a while you find out the daughter has like her own way, her own intention and maybe she is like the driving force yeah yeah so it's yeah it works really well yeah it does mm -hmm. and here's my copy of the film yeah loved ones Hi. a really beautiful cover mm -hmm. fun thing with this movie mm -hmm. uh this director 
We had another movie at the film festival called uh, The Devil's Candy, mm -hmm. and I really like that movie. It's beautiful yeah, shot. It has great music. Well. It's just like eerie and creepy. And in the program for the festival, they mentioned his early movie, uh, this one, The Loved Ones. Uh, so I said, or, or Sarah, if you know about this movie, and yeah, I have it. We can watch it. So that's my connection with The Loved Ones, and then we watch it again. Yes. Yeah. So yeah, what do you rate it? Mm, I'd give it a nine of ten. I give it a nine of ten yeah. as well because mm -hmm. it's yeah. it's so good. I, yeah. I love every aspect of the yeah. film. Same Script, here. characters, gore, ending, just yeah. Yeah. Everything. As I said, sometimes I have a problem when I like focus too much on just the gory stuff and just to show so much of the gore, just like to shock you, and they don't really care that much about story or characters. And I think this movie goes out of the way, and I really appreciate it. Yes. So thank you for watching our Valentine's Massacre of the Loved Ones. And if you haven't see it, seen it, watch it immediate, yeah. immediately. Mm -hmm. It's a good date movie. It really or is. Not. <laughs> Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Depends on who you're dating. Yeah. <laughs> but yes, don't forget to like and subscribe. And we'll see you the next time. Thank you, David, for thank today. Thank you. Thank you. Bye-bye. What is in my face? <gasps>